Hello, Pie Man here, and welcome back to Portal 2. And we'll be continuing on from where we left off. Because we wouldn't be continuing on from the start. Well, that wouldn't be continuing. Get off that science. Oh. Best test chamber ever. And it, this is the Hey! You made it! Where you at? There should be a, a portal dev device on that podium over there. Um. I can't see it though. No. Maybe it fell off. Do you want to go and have a quick look? Um. I am. So staring at me. It's alright, it's alright, just have a look about. You did this with me. I blame you. Hello? Can you see the portal gun? Um. No. Also, are you alive? If that's important, should have asked that first. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. Oh, good. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour. Then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. Alright? Brilliant. Go team! See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. Brilliant. Ew. There you are, you bastard. Nailed it. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah. So if no one's actually seen the bloody, um, bloody, the first portal, this is what happened. Um, scientists were doing shit. They bloody made Gladys in control of the whole fucking uh, laboratory, which was a bad idea. And shit happened. Because you shouldn't trust robots. Then bloody Shell was the work and retrieved the portal device and had cake. Damn it, it's only a one portal. Dead ass. Um. I don't want to go back there. Um. Nailed it. Hello. Ooh, a chair. Oh. Potato. No, oh, chair. Chair, what are you doing? Nailed it. Printer, copy a scanner thing. What portal do we have there? Um. Hmm. What's down here? Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all little military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. Brilliant. Um. Science, bitches. <laughs> If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Fuck. <laughs> 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 
This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost, almost, almost death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Deploy the smooth one. jazz. Dispenser, assist me. Thank you. Oh, hello. Hello, Poppy. Let's take that shit down. Do you even think of portals? Yay, more cubes and buttons. What? Oh, where am I? Ah, here. Nailed it. And that's how you tie it. Fuck this lagging. What? <laughs> Great work. Because this message oh, is pre-recorded. Any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Oh. Okay. Deadass. Oh. Okay, I may have let myself a bit go. Go a bit. Whilst in cryosleep. Not that much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, what? Um, okay. <laughs> oh, okay, no computers. Where am I going? Oh. How did I miss that? <laughs> oh. They get shit done. Right there. Where? Where are they? Oh. I mean, one of them was flying much higher than the other. If the Enrichment Center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris that was not a not be a deliberate part of the test. Oh. Um. Right. Oh. Um. Well, okay. Nailed it. Do you think three dimensional? Because I wouldn't say four dimensional, that's, there'd be time. Oh wait, no, it would come into play. Okay, um. What does this do? Oh. How oh, nice. Nailed it. Um. What now?
No, I have to. Okay, um. This button. Make a ramp. You don't probably need this to keep up. Be <laughs> science. Is this is science. Hmm. Um. What? Oh. Nailed it. Say yes, shit now. Whoop. Jump. 360 no scope. <laughs> Not even. <laughs> and. Brilliant. <laughs> Can't even get up a ramp. Nailed it. What is this Ah, that's fun. Well done. Take the Hedgehog Center to remind you that although circumstances may appear bleak, but you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Yay! This next test applies the principles of momentum to back movement back. through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. They really had a study plan for everything. Um. Oh, I thank you. Because <laughs> I never ever would have figured it out. Nailed it. Come on, I should be able to fit through that hole. Bloody hell. Yeah, it was worth a try. Fucking hell. <laughs> Box, where are you? Nailed it. Box? Where do you go? <laughs> There you are. Silly call. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future. And the future, and the future starts with you. No, it starts with F. Science bitches. Anyway, um... Oh, what are you doing? Um... Yep, that'll be all for this episode. Um, don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, um, and join me on a portalish adventure. <laughs> Get up it. And bye.